Yo, what's going on, you guys? Welcome back to another day, man. Hopefully, you guys are having a good day. Thank you for joining us at Suspense HD. If you guys like our videos, please make sure you drop a subscribe button, drop a like button. They'd be really appreciated that we know that you guys are liking our videos, man. And we will continue this video. Enjoy, guys. White privilege! White privilege! You mean you're so privileged that you can yell racism at folks? You just walked by a group of folks and yelled racism? Is this your store? I am a customer! So am I. So am I. I'm a customer too, Becky. She's having a breakdown because she just got caught being racist. You probably shouldn't be racist anymore. You should probably check. So number two, we know how Karens can be one-on-one -on -one Karen learning experience. This is gonna be a problem. We're not here during the day tomorrow or at night. You can't be here at night. No one's allowed to be here at night after dark. Okay, we were thinking night today after this Okay, but that's not the point. This is a public park. We know. And unless you have a permit, don't tell my child he can't play back here. We didn't say that. He's not going to tell you no. Okay, but I'm just letting you know, you can't come here tomorrow night, because the police will be here and you will be removed from here. And my child will come ride his bike. So, don't talk to other children. If I want to bring my dogs out here, you can record me all you want. You don't have a permit to be here. Would you like to Number three, how to be a route to a cashier by a Karen. Are you my doctor? No, but I'm telling you to put my it on or leave. My doctor has told me not to. Put it to. on or leave. No. Then you need to go. No. You're on the phone with the cops right now. And, and you as you know, that you are discriminating against me because I'm of my disability. I'm not discriminating against you, Miss. Yes, you are. I'm asking you to I have a disability and I I'm cannot sorry, wear a mask. I am told by my boss not to let you shop here if you don't wear a mask. I am told by so these So could I see a copy of your policy then, please? I don't have it with me, Miss. I would like if to see a copy of your policy. If you would like to come back tomorrow and... How to be on a live TV show and be a Karen. Billy Eichner. And, okay, all right, so, and is this like TV or? Yeah, this is like television, yeah. What television? Like Billy on the Street. Oh, okay, so are you an internet thing? Uh, no, it's actually a TV thing and an internet thing. I don't like your attitude. Okay, I don't like yours, I'm on TV. Who, who gives a shit? Who gives a shit about you, bitch? No. How to be a Karen and be a bad driver. So, look at her, so mad. Look at her. She's so mad. Yo, make that face again. Taliban and the Taliban, do they drive like that? Oh, the Taliban? Yeah. Right. Oh, like I give a shit. How about I already took a, a picture of your license? Hey, man, group of Karens. Like, that's something else. For the public. Private property. Read it out. You cannot offer it. Are you the public? Private. Not private property. Private property. Read it out. 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 Read it
Yeah, you, we will call the police if you touch anyone. Yeah, they've already touched Yes, we will call the police. Let's call the cops. There's the police. They are blocking them. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. No, she hasn't done anything. She's touched her. The employee touched her. Holy crap. Wow. Number now, this video is kind of different, man. One on one being a child molester and be a Karen. I'm Danny with 417 Predator Hunters. Oh, okay. Do you know why I'm here to talk to you tonight? Mm -hmm. You were trying to get a 15 year old girl to come over to your house and drink. No? She's inside right now. Okay. Well, what are you doing here? What are you doing here from? Where are you from? I was going to the bathroom. From where? where? Where'd you come from? From Branson? From Branson area? You're disgusting. You're picking up a 15 year old girl to bring home to your husband. No. That's nasty. You're a predator. Oh, she took the plates off her car. Oh, hey, why are the plates off your car, huh? Why you got the plates off your car? What are you doing? You're disgusting. Why are you here to pick up a kid, bro? Why are you here? Now we got another Karen who's a child molester for her husband, man. Yeah, what are you doing here? What are you doing here? Who are you waiting for? You just drove an hour and a half to a random gas station in Jacksonville. Who are you here to meet? You're here to meet a 15 year old girl. I just I just saw you on the phone. I got your pictures. I got your phone number. I got your husband's phone number, who's, by the way, a registered sex offender. Is he allowed to communicate with children? Is that you? A Karen, who's the security guard of the neighbors. Slow down, guys. So slow down. Put it away in two seconds. I'm sorry about that. OK, I'm going to slow down. Sorry. I don't know about you guys, but this video hurt my feelings, man. I don't know if you, let me know in the comments what you guys think, just please. Of course, we got another Karen who's in the Home Depot refusing to wear a mask and yelling. This is all a lie. It's all a lie. Could you please wear your mask for safety purposes? It's in a state law. That's the state oh, mandate. You gotta be it's safe. It's a lie. You gotta be Go safe. Go look at the box. Hey, you box. should take your meds. Nobody cares how you are. It's a lie. It's an absolute lie. Meanwhile, at the local home beach. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I didn't know it was just like people like that. No, no, she's been. Number. What do you do if you got a neighbor who is a Karen? Man, this guy teaches you one on one. Come pick up this nice pile of shit that your dog left in my yard. I've been waiting for you for two days. You. Disgusting. Disgusting. Look at it. I have children here. That's your dog. Please pick it up. This will be every day. I will watch you every day. I have you on video. Pick up after your dog. Please pick up after your dog. Please pick up after your dog. Thank you for picking up the feces from my yard. I appreciate it greatly. Greatly appreciate it. Please leave my yard. You're trespassing. Get off my yard, you and your dog. Thank you very much. Thank you for being a courteous neighbor. Thank you for picking up your dog feces, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah, come say hi to my friends. Say hi to them. Hello, my friend. <laughs> what the fuck? Why are you laughing, man? Huh? Why? You're lucky bitches. I'm gonna beat you.
your motherfucking ass, y'all. I'm gonna fuck y'all up about this shit. Y'all don't do that. No, y'all are supposed to rinse the dishes so they can go into the dishwasher. Get all that. Oh, my baby, my goddamn. Come here, motherfucker. Come here. Stop, stop, stop. Stop. Oh, shit. That's my hair. You wanna wash shit? Stop. Stop. Oh, no, no, no. You want me to wash some shit, huh? Let's wash some shit. Let's wash some shit. Let's wash some shit. Let's wash, motherfucker. The fuck out of here, my goddamn puppy. How to be a racist can and accuse someone of smoking marijuana. So this woman, I don't know what her name is, but I, I finished my food. I ordered a salad and I was just finishing up and she came up to me and she said, excuse me, sir, I'm sorry, but there's no smoking weed here. <laughs> and she assumed that I was smoking weed. That's because one of our patio people mentioned that someone was smoking weed. So. so why would she come up to me as a customer saying that I smoked weed and she just came up to me for no reason and assumed I, I think smoked they, weed? I think they just thought that that was who you, they pointed you out. And so that's why she pointed me out? No, but she said that somebody else said that I was smoking weed. Yeah, she so wasn't was, out there. One of our patio people said that. No, no, she said that somebody worked here said that. Patio people came and got her and said someone's smoking weed out there so she walked Somebody over. Somebody smoking weed. So why did she come over and assume that it was me, a black man? Because they pointed it out. Who? So a customer? No, the, no, the customer and the person out there. The, okay, the you're person. just making up stuff on I'm not. She's, 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 we have someone on the phone. No. I don't know if you were or not. I don't, I don't know why you would come up to me and assume I was smoking weed, but you were completely sure that I was smoking someone weed. Told and all I was doing was finishing my salad. You shouldn't come up to a black man that paid for a salad at your, at your place of work and assume that they smoke weed. And on top of that, you were harassing me and you did it in a very vulgar tone. I did not appreciate what you did. You should not do that, okay? Especially in your black history, man. Yeah. All right? You guys have a good day. This is what is going on. Take care. Rose, Rose, so I just want to give you guys context. That's the name of the rest. Food on the table when I get home. Food on the table straight to the kit. I'm just playing, honey. I'm just joking. Did the guy, you're not the only the man of the house, okay? You see the monkey? You see here. He's not a monkey. I'm just joking. Sir, can I ask you what that chain is? A leash? That's weird, bro. Are you okay? Are you safe? Do you feel safe? Hey, oh, is that your dog? No, it's my fucking cat, bitch. I need 10 on one. Okay. That's what you call a fucking cunt. Haha, <laughs> you going to jail. Cheyenne, how? Here's your. How to deal with your racist, caring neighbor that you can't do anything about it, man. Good luck. Neighbor, and take pictures and make my life difficult when I want to cut down trees and then do this. You're so full of crap. God, you've got me so mad right now. Well, that's what you get for being a neighbor. That's what you get. You get what you get. This is what your husband. You get what you get. You know that? I wouldn't have said boo to you, but you want to be a neighbor and sit out here and take pictures and video. Why we're sitting there trying to cut down trees, and all you can do is sit there and complain. Your neighbor, your own neighbor, has been assigned, get out. Does that give you a hint? When they spray paint on your side of the fence, keep off. Oh, so what's the deal? Why are you, why are you
like these guys on my lot. You want to be a tough neighbor, and I'm going to be tough back. I want them off my lot, and you're not putting anything there. The so fencing is being replaced at your husband. You know what? I, I'm, you know what? You created nothing but crap with all your picture taken. We're cutting down, down trees, which actually ultimately helped you. All right? We, we took back your property for you because it was great so many leaves and everything. What are you taking pictures? I'll call the cops. My husband told me to call the cops. You want me to do that? Yes, and I will show him where the property money is. You don't even have, you don't have no idea where the property line is. Well, you don't know what you're speaking about. You don't either, because you weren't here when I was put. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video, man. If you guys liked it, please, please drop a like, drop a subscribe. We really appreciate it. And make sure you guys share the video if you guys really, really love us and want us to grow. And we will be making more can videos. And don't hit us if you post by mistake a can video again. Because, like, can videos are hard to find, man. I apologize. But, like, there's not a lot of cans going on right now. Because they're at home now. Because of COVID. And, yeah, guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye.